foolish purple loop in its ladder. Don't post that on YouTube.
Everybody see that? Okay, great, here we go. All right, so this is how you add, you do a basic edit. Okay? Um, anybody in the front row need help? You already did this, you already did everything. You, you're gonna follow along? Okay, it just doesn't look like it. Do you have a person like that? No, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Okay, here we go. So, uh, this is how you do a basic edit. So, you see this footage here? This is your footage. So, what you want to do is down here, what I would do right now is hover over these little controls. So the first one says add marker, mark in. You see where I am, right? This control toolbar here. So I'll hover your mouse over that so you know where I am. And just read what it says add marker, mark in, mark out, go to in, right? That means go to the beginning. So you click on that, it goes right to the beginning. Uh, step back one frame, you can't do that yet, you can hit play, and then if you hit step back one frame, it'll literally just click back one frame. So you should be able to, to do that, and you can go ahead one frame, or you can click all the way to the end, right? And then there's insert, overwrite, and then export the frame. So these are all really, really good tools. Um, insert and overwrite, we'll get to it in a minute. Export frame is cool because if you want to take a still, a screenshot of just that, this frame, you can click on it and it'll give you the, the frame, like you can export that out. So if you want to get a still from a video, that's one way to do it. So here's what we're going to do. So go to your first clip, um, make sure you click on the list view, go to your first clip, and double click on it. Alright, whatever your first clip is clip is, this is probably it, okay? So, that's probably your first clip, let's go to that. So what you want to do is just, just hit play, and when you come to a point where you like what you see, stop it. I'm going to go to this frame right here. I like where he kind of like slides. And then, mark in. You see the mark in button here? Hit mark in. And then go to the end of your frame, wherever you think the last part should be. And I think it should be like right here for me. And then I'll hit mark out. So you want to mark in and mark out. That's what you want to do. So I'll do that again. Play window Z. I'll go back to my first clip. So I find the beginning.